Make way for the double champ. The following is a six-man tornado tag team match. Introducing first from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, The Rock. Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the double champ's face, but he's obviously earned it. Guess what, folks? It's time to acknowledge the Tribal Chief. And representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. The Tribal Chief has participated in some of the biggest matches we have ever seen including an absolutely unforgettable yeah! SummerSlam main event. The first last man standing match in SummerSlam history. Just one of countless memorable moments in the incredible career of Roman Reigns. And the scary part is, Saxton, the Tribal Chief is nowhere near finished. No one stands in the way of the head of the table for too long. Son of a dream looking to realize his destiny in WWE. Superstar who possesses an in ring IQ second to none. Well, Cody Rhodes has certainly learned from the best, and Rhodes has become even better in his time away from WWE. But is better good enough these days? He is the alpha male of our species. And Lesnar looking to dominate. And 
from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar's been a dominant force his entire career. Brock Lesnar has made a career out of steamrolling whoever has dared get in his way. You think there's any limit at all to the carnage that's to come here tonight? Oh, Saxton, you know better. We should expect nothing short of total decimation. <laughs> of course, Lesnar's never one for holding back. The Beast wins decisively. The Beast wins by ripping guys apart. but he's also really freaking good. And he has the titles and main events to prove it. And the WWE Universe serenading Rollins with his battle hymn. Time for Seth freaking Rollins to conduct another masterpiece. intimidating and imposing competitor in WWE history. And one of the most awe-inspiring entrances in all of sports entertainment. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, The Undertaker! The WWE Universe standing in reverence. No one embodies human suffering and inescapable peril more. Yeah, this isn't make-believe. It's like having real horror among us. A being who wields unspeakable power and transcends space and time. A dark fog envelops our arena, and the creatures of the night are upon us. Entering the hollowed ground of WWE's Hall of Fame just made the Phenom stronger. An awe-inspiring, truly frightening sight. The 
The Undertaker's opponent better get ready. He's about to meet his maker. Teams in their respective corners, we're going to get a chance to see The Rock, Roman Reigns, and Cody Rhodes. Then across from them, we see Brock Lesnar, Seth Rollins, and Undertaker. You know this is a tough match for superstars to play well with others. You really need to find a way to properly mix your skills with your partners. And Rock of Lions off their opponent. It's a Moku Bang! Snap suplex. Good technique reversing Rollins. A nice shot by The Undertaker. Now one of the best strikers in the business. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Neckbreaker! Strong kick. My goodness. Catches a punch. Into the ring 
from the floor now. Whoa, not quite yet. Crank in the head. Oh, not even now. Just hammering away with the lights. Oh. Elbows right to the forehead. I don't think anybody can stop the beast in Carter. Let's take another look.